now 5.30 in the morning. We just got up, got a couple hours of sleep last night. We're a little tired, uh, but now we're heading down to Key West for our fishing trip. Goodbye, cool apartment. I'll miss you. Goodbye. I've got my European backpacker right now. Got the front backpack, I got the back backpack. Got the laptop and everything, just covered in backpacks. Uh, but we are on our way to Key West now. As long as we don't hit traffic, we should make it. Hello? It's already been 20 minutes. Three and a half hours later, we made it to the uh, fishing trip, like five minutes before we're about to take off. So that was lucky. <laughs> All right, another cameraman. Is yep. that thing on? How's it go? Uh, yes, it is. What's up? How's it going? <laughs> so this is the first time in a long time that I've been on a boat, but I've been on a boat way more times than Josh and everyone else. I've actually gone on fishing trips and stuff before, and I've caught big fish, uh, even some sharks. <laughs> so uh, hopefully, hopefully I'll catch something cool today and show them what's what. You guys don't really know is that we lied about all this. We're actually going to Cuba. This is an illegal boat. <laughs> going back to home country. <laughs> from where we started and we're heading to the back of the boat now to go fishing. If only Steve took the tablets that you took. Yeah, I took this medicine tablet before I started. I never really went on a boat so I didn't know but I took it anyway. Steve. This is it. This is it. Come in the water. Yep. Sharks? And bring sharks too. We can get some blood in the water if we need. <laughs> You're more than enough. It's the start. Cody's first fish. He's hitting the big ones today. This is the beginning. This is what I'm gonna use to catch my next one. Yeah. <laughs> You're getting jacked up, guys. Everyone's stealing my, my uh, fish. <laughs> the fish are stealing my bait. That's the problem. How you feeling, Steve? Josh and I are just doing a bet on who can catch the biggest one. I couldn't even finish that stick. Look at that one. What kind is that? It's a red grouper. Red grouper. Oh, the one. So dinky guy. <laughs> Thanks. We're catching sharks out here. I'm trying. We will. Just you wait. They're out there. Holy crap. He's got a shark <laughs> attached. That is huge. That's serious. That's a real shark right in front of my face looking at me. I don't know. Here, put him close to you. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> who, so who caught it? Let's see what it is. It's railing in. Railing it in. Drag it in! It is a tail rock to be honest with you. They're running with the dolphins! Awesome. Yeah. Safe travels, Thanks, Thanks so much. California, yeah. man. <laughs> Thank you. So if you guys liked our fishing adventure, make sure you check out Gulfstream. I'll have the link down below. I only caught one fish. Josh caught like six. Uh, Steve and John, none because they weren't feeling well. But it was a fun time all around. You should check them out. Gotta go to Starbucks for that on the road upload. <sighs> the traveling YouTuber's life. We have such packed days of like activities that we always try and do. But then editing and uploading the same day just doesn't always work because a lot of times the Wi-Fi is terrible so then we have to stop and uh, you know go try and do it but we just run out of time to do all these things. We run out of time and that's the big thing is running out of time to upload these videos. No. It does have the New Orleans feel though.
So this is the very first ship ever made here. Not actually true, but you know, wouldn't that be cool? I think it's just a little prop. I love the look of these islands, like the trees and the old, old buildings behind it. It reminds me of Cuba. It is Cuba. We took the boat. Oh yeah, I forgot. We did, we did end up in Cuba. Key lime pie. Apparently Key West is known for their key lime pie. They have key lime pie on a stick, frozen. They have key lime uh, shampoo. Even over here, they have another key lime pie bakery across the street. I mean, every other store we see is like key lime pie. Look at this tree. It looks like a haunted house right here. If it wasn't daylight and had all these signs. Just, just let me just make that darker and you can imagine how spooky this would be. <laughs> Those guys think you're drunk, Josh, because you're so slow. Dude, I think it's really slow, <laughs> but these shoes are crap to, to run in like that. When I get my hey man, back you agreed on, to the race that happens. Yo, I did agree to it. it. I lost, fair and square. <laughs> So we just finished up here in Key West. We're heading out now. We're driving all the way up to Orlando. It's like an eight hour drive. On the way up, there's a stop we're doing at an abandoned mansion, possibly, if it's not dark. We'll see. Now we're on the side of a highway. We're actually walking to this island. It's an abandoned island off the side of the uh, Key West. And we're going to explore this place at night. It's pretty windy here. It's also right on the side of the water and the highway. So the only source of light right now are these cars coming by. Footstep, right? Yeah. Guys, here's footstep. Yeah. Up the car is right here. Just pulled over. When we got here, there was a car right here. So we thought, oh, maybe that was it. But well, the car is gone before we even got back. So it definitely wasn't that, which makes it even creepier. Wondering what happened, uh, we were all standing there at the front door, just standing still, and we heard birds flying around inside. And then none of us were moving, but then we heard footsteps inside, like right inside the door. So we all just booked it down the stairs and got out of there because we've had a lot of issues at night with uh, homeless people and, you know, going into these places at night. So. We just didn't want to take a chance. We got this whole road trip ahead of us. We couldn't have anything happen. So we just booked it out of there and we got out of there. I mean, there is a cool picture of it, which we got uh, from in front of it. And it re looked really cool at night. It was like all foggy and it was on the water. So we got that cool picture. But unfortunately, we didn't get to fully explore the place. From what it looked like at the entrance of the mansion, we didn't miss too much. So I'm glad about that. It was just a big, empty, hollowed out uh, mansion that was never finished. But uh, it would have been cool to look around a little bit. Unfortunately, we had to get out of there. So, guys, you're off. <laughs> Seriously. 